deep in the ocean as America's first underwater colony. Sonar contact. Sonar contact down here. 200 meters. 150 meters. Soon, it will be the last. Deep Star 6 is the new thriller from director Sean Penn. What this film is about, in part at least, is being underwater, and the threat is the water itself. Everybody has been underwater for five seconds too long, and it's absolutely terrifying. Right, we'll have you out in two seconds. I'll get out, get out now. The Deep Star 6 team has been in their underwater lab for six months. Their mission, to install a missile silo beneath the ocean floor. Captain. You've been working too hard, Scott. I want you to take the day off. Rest. But I got it. That's in order. Yes, sir. You know, that's great. Uh, after breakfast, I could help you with a few sets. Uh-huh. You'll fix the leak in the docking bay after breakfast. Oh, okay, but then after that, I think I could just and help. Then after that, you'll fix the start in DSRV-1. All right, exactly, but I think after that, I think after if I... that, you report to me for another work assignment. Torian Black. Nancy Everhard, Greg Evigan, Miguel Ferrer, Nia Peoples, Matt McCoy, Cindy Pickett, and Marius Wires portray the crew of Deep Star Six. Each member of the Deep Star Six team will ultimately confront his worst fears as the group faces the terrifying sea creature they've unintentionally released from an underwater canyon. I think it'd be anywhere. Just the job. It's an adventure. He's kind of a reluctant, reluctant hero. Doesn't really want to get involved, but uh, was really rather just put in the time and you know, get the hell out of there. After six months, we're going to get out of here. And then uh, two hours later, we're not going anywhere. What the hell is that? Look at that mother. I think we're in big trouble, boss. We've lost contact with the sea cat. Well, what do you want me to do about it? Give me the captain. The captain's busy, and so am I. Get laid law now, Snyder. <laughs> yes, ma'am, right away. I don't want to play the victim, and a lot of women's roles are that. Collins definitely is not a victim. You know, she's she's um, right out there fighting for herself. Snyder is very good at his job. He's a, a communications sort of computer expert. Uh, he's a little bit unstable, wrapped a little tight, being six miles into the ocean for a number of months, and. Uh, is certainly the most unstable of the group. Snyder, it works. How do you know? I am not going down there with that defective piece of shit. Wait a minute, hold it. Okay, it works. Scaring people is not easy. What usually happens is that uh, uh, most films that purport to be scary are not very scary at all. They are often gross. But if you create a situation in which you're sincerely rooting for one of the main characters and are afraid that something is going to happen to that person, that can become scary. 